China's J-20 stealth fighter seems to have a new upgrade recently. A photo surfaced online shows a different radar dome comparing before. With some enhancement to the photo, the new outline of the edge of the radar dome can be clearly seen. Although this is an older J-20 prototype, the radar dome has changed and seems to be tested on board this J-20 to check it in real flights. If we look at another J-20 fighter, we can see the serrated edge of older radar dome is not the same as the latest one. I am putting the two photos side by side, this will give you a much better view how the difference is. The highlighted part has tips of serrated edge shifted a bit to another position. It is a small change, but it might need there was greater concern about this part. Clearly the designing organization of J-20 fighter, Chengdu Aircraft Group, decided change to the radar dome is necessary. Considering there have been around 200 J-20 fighters in service, the reason might be in long-term deployment, this particular part has structural issue to be changed. Also Chinese Air Force released video showing the J-20 firing a PL-10 air-to-air missile. This is the first video showing such activity publicly. The PL-10, nicknamed Thunderbolt 10, is a potent short-range air-to-air missile developed for J-20, J-16, J-10 and other Chinese military aircrafts. Designed for carried internally in the stealthy J-20, it packs a punch in a compact package. Thrust vectoring technology allows the PL-10 to perform sharp turns and chase down nimble opponents, such as the US F-22 and F-35 fighters. Video clips also show the J-20 receiving aerial refueling. The tanker aircraft is the Chinese YY-20 based on the largest military aircraft in China, the Y-20. The J-20 fighter has its refueling rod hidden inside its fuselage and can be extended when needed. The J-20 can carry four external fuel tanks for ferrying or supporting long-range strikes. There is another photo showing possibly a dual-seat J-20's fighter trainer. This type of new variant is being tested in Chengdu at the moment. It is expected the J-20s not only can perform training tasks, it is more aiming for highly sophisticated strike missions, such as countering enemy air defense or controlling combat drones. The second pilot provided additional capacity. Thank you for watching. Please click like, subscribe, share and comment.